When somebody wants to propose to his or her loved one, what will he or she need is probably a diamond ring and the famous but cliche line, will you marry me? Hi, I'm Adriana and welcome to this episode of Fun Facts. Today, let's talk about diamonds. Diamond is a solid form of the element carbon with its atoms arranged in a crystal structure called the diamond cubic. It has the highest hardness and thermal conductivity of any natural material, properties that are used in major industrial applications such as cutting, polishing tools, and of course your wedding ring. Most natural diamonds have ages between 1 billion and 3.5 billion years, so if you have a diamond ring or other jewelries with diamonds, it might be the oldest thing you'll ever own. How to choose a diamond, let's say, for your proposal night or just for yourself? The first thing you should know is, according to the most scale invented in 1812 to measure the hardness of minerals, Diamond is ranked to 10 on the scale. It can scratch everything below it, but nothing can harm it. But the trick is, diamonds can scratch each other. That means only a diamond can scratch a diamond. So remember to keep your diamond ring away from any other diamond jewelries if you have any. After knowing that diamonds can be easily scratched, we will start to choose the best diamond. Follow the 4C standard, which is carat, clarity, color, and cut. Carat is a weight of unit for precious gems. One carat equals to 200 ml or 0.00 ounces. Do remember it's carat, not carat, and of course not carat. Carat is a unit of purity for gold. Pure gold is 24 carats. The largest diamond ever found was the 3,006.7 carats cullinan discovered in South Africa in 1905. It was later cut into nine separate stones. One of the nine called Cullinan I, aka the Great Star of Africa, was the largest polished diamond in the world and weighed 530.2 carats until they found the Golden Jubilee Diamond in 1985, which weighs 545.7 carats. You might have seen the Great Star of Africa but didn't realize it because it is part of the crown jewels in the UK. It is hard to tell the difference between a real diamond and a fake one, so get advice from a gemologist before you buy it. That's all for today's fun facts. Hope you can hand your perfect diamond one day. See you next time.